All right, we're just about to uh, put a border onto this Pala Chevy and Pala logo sign here. You guys can see that. It's hard to get this with the reflection, but that's what we're working on. And I'm just going to do a border around it with some uh, some nice corners in that. And then I'll punch some holes in it later and uh, dimple dye those. So we're using the uh, Jamie Jordan stencil dies here. I've got about uh, a 1 8 inch offset of my dies for this border. Um, you can go bigger, you can go 3 16 It just depends on the look you want for your signs and that. So we're going to get set up here and you can watch along. I'm going to start right up over here. Right about there, and just down till it touches, and then we'll go another turn, turn and a half roughly, and then we'll start start rolling here. So, and we don't have enough uh, enough of a line here. We'll go over it again and give it another quarter of a turn, and go again. We should be pretty close here for what I wanted to uh, a turn and a half on this one here. And we just follow down the line until we get down to this end. And then we'll stop and reset. Speed her up a little bit here. corner hope you guys can see this good enough I'm trying to get the light adjusted properly I'm just following that line just on the outside edge of this wheel is where I'm keeping my line that I'm following here. And I just use a fine line sharpie to do these lines as well. Take a little thinner on a damp rag there and give it a wipe after and get rid of all the, the sharpie marks on it and clean it up. She's ready to go. Almost done here. We just got this next corner to, to do out and we'll see if we need to do another pass or not. We might be good with just one pass.
Okay. I'm not sure if you guys can see that very well there. Didn't get the light reflecting the right way so you can see it, but I think we're good with just one pass. Got just a nice uh, border there, kind of outlining the Chevy Impala logo on that. So, not this might be any better or worse. There you go. Kind of see it there. So there you go. Chevy and Palo logo done. Just got to clean her up now. Wipe her off some some uh, some thinner. Get rid of all the sharpie lines and that. And clean it up. A little bit of polish, and we're we're done. We're ready to go. Stay tuned.